Hello students. Today we are going to do question number 7 of exercise 5.2 chapter 5 understanding elementary shapes class 6 mathematics. Where will the hour end of a clock stop if it starts from 6? First one from 6. It starts from 6. And turns through one right angle. And we know one right angle, three hours. So let's write the key points. For every question, the key point is same. Key point is one right angle, three hours, two right angles, six hours. 3 right angles, 9 hours, and 4 right angles, 12 hours. So, these are the key points you must notice. Okay. So, now let's do from 6. We are at 6. And turns through one right angle. So one right angle. When we turn through one right angle. That means three hours. Now let's move three hours. In clockwise direction. So one, two, three. So we stopped at nine. So our end of a clock stops at nine. So it stops at the our end of a clock stops at 9 o'clock. Now comes and this is clockwise. So make arrow also. Next one from 8 and turns through two right angles. Now you are at 8. This is 8. Two right angles means 6 hours. So right first. Two right angles. Equals to 6 hours. So let's move 6 hours. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So we reach at 2. So it stops at 2 o'clock. Now the third one, C1. From 10. Now we are at 10. From 10. And turns through 3 right angles. And now we know 3 right angles. How many hours? 9 hours. So let's move 9 hours. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So we reach at 7. Clockwise direction. So it stops at 7 o'clock. Now comes to the last one. From 7 and turns through 2 straight angles. 2 straight angles. 2 straight angles means 4 right angles. And 4 right angles means 12 hours. So we have to move 12 hours. From 7. So here it is 7. Now 12 hours. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So, again at the same point. Means 7 o'clock only. So, it stops at 7 o'clock only. So, I hope you understood how we have to do these questions. So, thank you so much for watching the video.